it's fun to interact with the students and I, I feel like uh, maybe one of my main goals is to, to convince the students that I'm not really that special. <laughs> David Wineland may not think he's special, but he has had a very successful career spanning four decades in physics. Back in 1978, he was the first scientist to achieve laser cooling, trapping ions, electrically charged atoms, and using lasers to cool them to near absolute zero. Since then, working at NIST, the National Institute of Standards and Technology, David has designed one groundbreaking experiment after another, testing theories in quantum physics and demonstrating applications for atomic clocks and quantum computing. In 2012, he shared the Nobel Prize in physics. I'm Brian Mallow, and I spoke with David at the 2016 Lindau Nobel Laureate meeting, and I was really struck with how nice and humble he is. And despite a career filled with achievements, or maybe because of it, he had a really nice message for the young attendees from around the world. You know, naturally, a lot of students, you know, they think, put us on a pretty high pedestal. And I think, uh, certainly in my own case, I don't, I'm not any smarter than most of these students here. Probably you can tell from my way of speaking, it doesn't take, the, take me long to convince that I am a pretty normal person. Now there's some outliers, you know, someone like Einstein was really singular, really. Uh, but I'm... I'm not like Einstein. I, I, I really am like these students. So I think the one, I hope the one value I can, can have in interacting with the students is, is to convince them they can, maybe they aren't going to win a Nobel Prize, but they certainly can, can be successful in the, in the careers, uh, line of research, for example, they might choose. So.